So we've got KPIs that we want to track. We said, all right, we're going to choose to implement a CMS because we know what we want to track and what we want to get out of it. How do you choose the right one now? So this is a hard, hard <laughs> part of this. Um, I think in all honesty, what, what organizations need to do is they need to make their list of what do they want the CMMS to do for them. Once they have that list of everything they want the CMMS to do, they got to go through and define what are must haves, what are nice to haves, right? And really figure out which one is going to work for them the most. Um, a lot of, I don't, I hear from a lot of different organizations, well, we want our CMMS to integrate to this and integrate to this and integrate to this. But in reality, there's no way IT is going to let anyone integrate to this thing. So why is that a must have? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So I think the big thing is really just one part, understand our must haves or nice to haves. The other big thing is to me, how user friendly is it? Um, we want our frontline techs to use this. If they, if it's command based, like old MS DOS for anyone who remembers that, um, getting them to do that is not always going to be easy. So what's the user interface? Is it easy to use? Um, is it mobile? Right. That's, a, that's a big thing for a lot of organizations. Um, can it run on a tablet? You know, those types of things I see become more and more important. Uh, but once again, it kind of goes back to user friendliness as well as must haves, nice to haves, that type of analysis. 